What do you guys think about the anime so far? The first two episodes in terms of animation quality, soundtrack, voice acting, amazing. Even the premise of the anime itself of it being like a, a game of deceit, a deceit and lying. And you're trying to like climb the ranks and gather stars and this mystery of the red star. And like, why is she a body double? That, that's pretty good. But something's missing because where's the mind games like Classroom of the Elites? Basically, there's a company and this company is a bunch of girls that can just hack into the enemy phone and we win without us doing anything. I'm thinking to myself, is this really mind games? I feel like it's a little bit of an ass pull, but it's only the first two episodes. Let's let it cook. Let's begin today's reaction. <laughs> All right, it ended with this guy just laughing at the top. <laughs> what a Wait, how did he jump from that top and <laughs> no <laughs> fall damage? <laughs> nice teeth. Oh, okay, he's talking big. Your star. My god. So this is like uh, her, the Empress's simp number one. But he's so chuny. Maybe he's good. Let's find out. Five stars. He has five stars. <laughs> Lightning came down. <laughs> what is this intro? Oh, this fucking maid man. Huh? What, what, what? You know her? Oh, interesting. Oh, another person? Well, it's fine. She's, she's, our, she's on our side. Like, it shouldn't be a big deal. Why? From what? Psychological distress? From what? Collect cards and compute four numbers. Am I following? Nope. And then you compare the different cards against the enemy, and then whoever has the biggest number wins? Okay. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's different though. We're, we're built diff. It's totally different. We're gonna make history. But everyone thinks that he's a seven star, don't they? And that's the lie that we're going with? You know, people will believe him no matter what. I'm not following. Holy Night Brigade, 300 members. Are they all simps? Are all 300 people the simps for the emperor? Empress? I am not following, bro. You're not explaining enough to me. What the fuck is going on? But uh, he's got some powers. Like, they expect us, the audience, to understand every one of these different jargon and terminology that they fucking half-ass explaining. This is going at such a fast fucking pace. I have no clue of any of these abilities or skills. But basically, get a lot of cards. Big number card wins. That's it. Okay. It's the same commentator every time. The Nia girl, the cat girl. Are we really gonna run? There's no fucking motorcycle. Okay, public bus route. I can't believe the company won't give us a car. They're going pretty fast. We're not even on our first. Huh? It's unrevealed cards. I don't know any of these abilities! Okay, he just knows where all the shit is already and he's picking up cards that's not on their phone display. Oh wait, he even hit- He's fucking even hacking the- The audio, what? The black wings ability. That's pretty useful in terms of utility, I guess. Yeah, what's up? You want to keep talking? Mm -hmm. What? He's so edgy, man. <laughs> Even that laugh. Until what? Two seconds? Huh? He said we're doing fun, something fundamentally wrong. So find them all for. Am I following this? No, I am not following this at all. He's just basically being able to get all the cards, though. Okay. What the fuck is going on? Bro, I. There's like 20 different things happening and no explanations. 
But the company has more than just her. Don't we have more support? Motorcycle, some kind of vehicle. Sionji Empress? No, it's the girl that we beat last episode. Oh, perfect. Hey, that works out. I can't believe the company didn't give us a bike, man. Technically, even during their duel, they didn't even give us a bike. They just made us fucking walk. Granted, it was an easy battle, but still. Ah, okay, okay, okay. They're providing support. Bye -bye. <laughs> Thanks. Uh, maybe she's not too happy because we beat her. Hmm? What? It's right there. Just jump, bro. How, how do you get it? <laughs> you need to fucking throw your phone. Ah, it looks like a soft landing. Come on now. That yeah, doesn't look too bad. Like, <laughs> bro fell regardless. So you're telling me everybody in this fucking stadium is getting hyped, looking at a screen for ne fucking cards to pop up. There's no actual, like, uh, camera of people doing their work. They're just fucking watching a screen. Oh, a number 17 card popped up. Oh my god, kind of thing. Oh, yeah, your piece is gone. Sayonji. We don't. Oh, he's actually even bleeding. Never mind. I thought that was a. I thought the stuff below was gonna soften his ball, but bro is fucking bleeding. The childhood friend, right? Okay, here's my theory. The childhood friend is the real Sionji. You know, her body, her. You know, the one that she's like, acting as a dupe. Because doesn't that make sense? Well. No, it doesn't make sense. It's, it's, it's just like, you know, there's this girl that disappeared a long time ago. And it just happened there's a girl, you know, that's someone as important as the Empress that also disappeared. So, like, it, it's, there's not much to go off of it. There's no proof, but I think it's a feasible guess. Huh? What the fuck? Are you the real one that... Okay, still the dupe, didn't get kidnapped, just basically went to a normal school. Huh. <laughs> I am a genius after all. Yo, do we even have time to be having this discussion? Hey, we gotta get our cards, man. <laughs> my man making moves while bleeding out his head. What do you mean, what do you mean? You're my type. Hey, but we don't fucking have time. Guys, guys, we gotta get going. The cards. How many cards do we have? We have like two, right? Like, wait, wait. The, 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 he has so many cards already. How are we gonna compete? What the? F we can't win. It does, doesn't they have to display five cards against five cards and you flip each one? We don't even have five cards. The company's really struggling. I mean, I did say in the beginning that I didn't want the company to bail them out every time. So, let's see what we got. Rule break. <laughs> uh, can we? We can't. We're one star. Rule breaker. You just overwrite the game's rules. Why don't we just say who has someone who has like a uh, lower cards wins the fucking game then? They're watching a fucking still screen. Okay, never mind. We're finally back. Okay, let's go. Yeah, we only have two cards. But if we can use rule breaker, then it doesn't really matter now, does it? Like, how does even work? We only have two cards to compare against this five. Huh? No, 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 no. No, stop now, cat girl. Hold up. Where's the rule breaker, Tom? Hmm? Hmm? What? Condition. I have no, I have no idea. You fucked the cards and you... Yeah. I don't know. Is he just buying time? What is he doing? One side takes more rounds to... What? 
So he was just stalling. Eh. Rule breaker. He just changed the game's rules. I mean, you're just totally gaslighting it. Maybe somebody just fucking changed the rules. Are you working for something? Bro, you haven't done a single fucking thing. You're just ass pull and ass pull and ass pull. Like, what now? Number manipulation? I don't know. Oh, the card's back. Yeah. Huh? Is this just gaslighting? Oh, that's the display! That's... Ho hold up, w was that really rule breaker then? It w was it just display modification or whatever? Because he discarded them. Because he made him think that he used rule breaker. But I... Uh... uh? <laughs> I, that's that's not not him. I, I'm the other guy's face fan. Like, what the fuck just happened? So hold up. He made him think that he used rule breaker by changing the visuals of the phone, but that wasn't actually rule breaker. Made him discard the cards, and then he used rule. I I don't know. No no. It was all just a bluff, and then he brought the card out somehow because he never yielded. Now he wins. I need someone to explain this to me, man. <laughs> He's totally rizzed up because of what he said, huh? You're just my type was all that was needed. Hiding true abilities. I mean, he is pretty smart. My t what do you think? You need him to say it to your face? You're not even talking to her. Really? What? Really? You're just gonna ignore that? They're getting so close, even though, like, it's in three episodes. Did we really bond that much last episode? Not really. Like, it's been pretty hostile, and suddenly she's all just... She's just so into him. Alright. Bye, I guess she's just gonna simp over him now. Yes, even the my type was a lie. Is it just me, or is everything going just so fucking fast with like little to no explanation? It's hard to keep up. Maybe I'm just dumb. Yeah, I'm just too dumb for this anime. This anime is way too smart for me, man. At the end there, so like the rule breaker is a five star thing. You can't use it because he's only one star, but technically he has to lie that he's a seven star. I still don't know if he's able to use it or not, but it doesn't really look like he used rule breaker, it, right? He gaslighted the guy thinking, okay, the text changed on your phone, therefore the rule was changed. But no, that was just some different ability to visually impair the phone. And then the guy just discarded his cards, but technically the main character didn't discard his cards somehow. I, I don't know, and then he brought it back and just wins. I guess that's a big brain play. I'm just happy that the company didn't bail him out this time. That's a little bit of an interesting twist that the the real Silent June wasn't kidnapped. And my theory that the you know the main character's like long lost childhood friend is the real Silent June, probably not. I'm just it's just a haymaker guess, man. I'm just fucking just theorizing. But eh, eh, we won by ourselves this time. If you're still here. If you did enjoy this reaction, please like the video. Check out the other playlist for even more content. And until next time, take care.